国际上大的天文项目，无论是空间和地面的，国际合作都是它的一个典型的特点，也是个最好的合作。通过这个合作呢，我们把啊不同的人放到了一起，我们把不同国家的它的技术的强项放到了一起，它的科学强项放到了一起。同时呢，我们这样的运行的效率，是我们在研究的时候把各种最好的智力也放到了一起，这样呢，能够产生一个非常好的结果particular object uh, we call this object gamma ray burst so gamma ray burst seems to sign the death of very massive stars and in fact more precisely it seems to sign the death of the first stars so studying in fact the gamma ray burst using the gamma ray burst as a tool to do Uh, observe the early universe, we can have, we can observe maybe the first stars. And this is very interesting because this is the only way to do that.
在我参与的国际合作项目当中，它确实是最深入的。在我了解到的国内参与的或者国际的上，中国跟呃我们的呃国际合作伙伴参与的项目当中，它也是最复杂的。这是我作为项目参与全过程的人员啊，所以它的持续的时间长，它涉及的人员多，它合作的层面的。重深度、深，这些都是我认为是前所未有。that since 20 years uh, China uh, developed a lot of institutes and a lot of capabilities in fact uh, to perform satellite instruments space instruments and now they have reached a very high level maybe in some cases better than us. Catalog of gamma ray burst, and all uh, the, 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 the let's say the scientific data of them will be public and uh, will be in fact distributed to the world scientific community. And I think thanks to that, uh, it will bring a, a very efficient uh, effort uh, to enhance our knowledge.